Okay, so hi everyone. You're welcome to the Chaos Project Managers meeting. Uh, my name is Yiga and this meeting occurs every other week, right? Um, there's no pressure. You can turn on your cameras or turn them off if you'd like. The meeting notes are somewhere here. Let me share them real quick or if somebody else can. The one thing that we're going to be talking about today, of course, everyone knows, everyone on this call actually knows what chaos is about. Um, so what the project managers team is essentially trying to do is to ensure that all of the projects within chaos are managed and the workflow is great. The workflow is perfect as with any other um, project management um, team or project management role that you're, you're having, right? The one thing that we use, our major tool is GitHub, of course, because we're fully open source. So we use the GitHub project boards for our work. The other thing that we have, we have a spreadsheet. I don't know if I can share my screen real quick. Akili, I'd like to be able to share my screen. Sure, try. Let me see if it's possible. Okay, I think I'm sharing my screen already. Can everyone see my screen? Hi everyone, can you see my screen? Yes. 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 Okay. <laughs> okay, awesome, awesome. Okay, so we have a couple of projects that are ongoing. Mm, for the record, um, myself, Peculiar, and Busayo are co-chairs of the project management team. So one of the things that we discussed in our previous meeting was that we would each drop off because we're handling a lot of projects or maintaining a lot of projects. So we're going to handle just one each. So for each person, they're going to just choose one project to handle so that it leaves more space for other team members we want to be a part of, you know, project managing projects. So currently this is finished. The chaos one is finished. Myself and Rhoda were the project managers that handled that. There's a lot of space here currently. We have the budget bot projects. Um, and they can, you know, uh, you know, knowledge leads. I know that Adeika is currently a knowledge lead. So, but we have to confirm from her if she still wants to be a pro project manager instead of being a knowledge lead, right? So what essentially we'll be doing is making sure that all of these things are, their workflow is better. So I don't know if we can put that an action item to reach out to our day in her to be sure if this space is, is free. So the other place, we have three spaces here. One, two, the Slack bot, the badging bot. We have one space um, on the badging website and for accessibility auditing, we need somebody else to join Busayo. So I don't know if we want somebody on this call wants to take that up. Gloria, um, would you like to take that up? Hi, Yiga, can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you. Okay, so I had previously indicated interest for the badging websites, but if that's like um, already being managed by someone, I can definitely take up the accessibility audit with Busayo. Okay, okay, so that's amazing because why, I'm sorry I put you on the spot, but so for the budget website, I see question marks by the side of people's names, right? So that means that we need to go back to them and confirm. And I don't think it would just be nice for us to remove people like that without getting their confirmation, if you get what I mean. So yeah, I um, that's why, yes. So, but I would also put, let me put your name real quick here. Um, Gloria. Um, okay, somebody just changed this. Um, so this is Chidalu. I think that, I don't know what we think. What do we think? Should we give, should we reach out to these people? Because of course the PM group has not been well, um, having meetings regularly. So it's possible that these people kind of dropped off without really meaning to drop off. I don't know what the house thinks. What do we think we should do? I know that Hamza is- 
Yes, hi. Hi, hi Iga. We had this meeting earlier and we have already done that. So um you weren't there, so we have you could look at uh, uh the meeting agenda we have already done all this. Oh, okay. Oh, sorry about that. Um, so what do we do now? We're going to put Gloria here. So Hamza is on this call. Hamza, can you confirm if you'd still like to maintain the budget website? We are here to confirm from them. Uh, sorry? Oh, so Peculiar, sorry, just give me one second. So Peculiar is saying we had already done that. And she also said that we're yet to confirm from them. So. I just want to please clarify which it is. Yeah, I said we have yeah. reached out to them, but we're waiting oh, for them to confirm. To reply. Oh, okay, okay. Okay, thank you so yes. much, Akilia. Thank you. Yes, so I'm that thinking that for anybody interested now, we might just like wait until we confirm from those ones and then we can then move ahead. Okay, okay. So... We have Hamza here already. Um, we also have slots for new PMs. So for the Greenwall Lab, we for the Ogo, we have new PM slots for Ogo as well. So I think we can just do that first. And then in subsequent meetings, depending on the replies that we get, we can then assign them or unassign people. Right, so that's that's my thoughts. Hamza, please go ahead. This is already. Oh yeah, uh, that's okay for me. So uh, I am here because you got reach out to me via DM, uh, the trying to remind me about this particular meeting because to be honest, I don't know um, whether this meeting existed or not. So I don't know how did my name appears over there, uh, but uh, it's a budget website is. Um, it's a particular project that I had been uh, looking around uh, very closely this year. And I see there is a lot of uh, contribution that I would like to offer in that budget website project. So thank you for whoever <laughs> put my name over <laughs> there. I, honestly, I can't even recall whether it's me that put my name there or someone. Right. right. So, I assume that it's me, so I'm going to thank myself for that. <laughs> so, uh, <laughs> and then uh, thank you, Peculiar, once again for reminding me that I'm a, I'm a maintainer on this particular website because I see there are a lot of um, unattended issues and then there are a lot of things that I need to create issues to that and also participate on that. Some of them I can even assign myself to. And then, mm -hmm. so then I can like to like um uh drop them so that someone can pick interest in them. Thank you. Okay, so thank you so much, Hamza. So I'm going to remove the question mark at the back of your name so it's confirmed. Um, I also think that it's a great idea that you're literally on the on the projects that you've been trying to work on or trying to look around this year. It would give you more ideas on what is going on in the project and you'll be fully involved in it so thank you so much for doing this I don't yeah know once again uh, once again i think um someone's before i unmute my mic someone's uh um display interest show interest on the same particular project and i think it's an it's a good idea to have a room for like um two maintainers on a particular mm. project. Yes, yes, I, I agree with you. And that's why there are two names here. If you look at it, there's a PM, um, there's PM one and two. So there are two people that are actually going to be maintaining the project at every time. Just oh, wow. so that I didn't even look I didn't even <laughs> look the title. So um yeah. what my what my mind was um was popping up over there was like okay it seems like this guy is president and this guy is vice president. <laughs> <laughs> oh no oh no okay no so um what what we do is so if you take a look 
right now for the accessibility auditing, it's going to be Busayo and Gloria that will be will be project managing that um, the project. So the technical lead is simply somebody that is actively working on the different parts of the project. Technical and knowledge lead, it's one and the same thing, right? Um, so they're knowledgeable about what is going on in the project and they're the people that you can ask questions on. what is going on right so um that covers it for you yeah it does thank okay. you so i think okay okay so is there somebody that would like to work on the grimoire repos and doc so this is a very simple um something that's very Sorry, come over again. Which one again is simple? I'm looking for maintainer. Very simple, actually. <laughs> I'm trying to open it up. So what that okay, so this is what this is about. It's basically going into this spreadsheet. So there are tabs, right? Responding, closing, and triaging issues, merging and closing PROs. So all of this, myself and Busaya were initially working on this together. Um, so what, what it entails is ensuring that the Grimoire Lab issues and PR backlog is... So there's a lot of PR backlog issues that you know have not been worked on. So we're grouping them, or we were grouping them, right, into different sections so that it's easy for the Grimoire Lab team to say, oh, hey, this is what we need to work on. This is what's going on in this section. So that's really what this is about. So I don't know if there's anybody that would like to handle that on this call to project manage it. Anybody? And if there's somebody, that's also fine. That's also fine because we can take it to the group, right? We can take it to the group and then would get you know more people as long as we're able to figure this out the first three we actually have one two three four five five spots that we're not sure so yeah i think that's all for my end i would hand over to peculiar peculiar is going to work us through github projects so that it's easy for us to, you know, use the tool. So over to you, Becky. Yeah, I'll stop sharing my screen. Um, hello, everyone. Um, welcome to Project Management Meeting. Um, just like you guys say, this is going to be by weekly meetings where we we take uh, we know, want to know the status of the meeting of the project you are working on if there's any issue that you might want us to look into as a project management group or then can report on what's going on on your project and other things you might want to us to uh, look into like uh, you already mentioned that we use project management board for managing our projects. Right now, when we look at some projects in, in on GitHub, we'll see that some project management board has been created, right? So um, that is to say some PM that showed interest before uh, worked on those and created those project management board. But Aside from that, if the project you want to manage is, there's no project management board, you can also like create or let us know. So we give you uh, access to be able to create a project management board for that project. So you can monitor and know what's going on on your own project. 
So one thing about uh, project management is that for you to manage a project, it's very, very important that you know a lot, you have a good knowledge about the project you're managing. Like for open source projects, it's quite different because the project is already existing, but there's some project that maybe you start managing from scratch. That means following from design and uh, the developers to what you already know such projects, you know everything about the project. But for open source projects, like these already existing. So the best thing or the best way to start is for you to, first of all, try to understand that project, know what the project is all about, and the, pro the problem that that project is solving. That way you'll be able to like manage the project very well. Like someone has mentioned that he's been working on a particular project. Uh, it's easier to manage that project because you have quite no, a good knowledge of what's going in and what's going out. Then creating, on, or for, creating issues on such projects will be very easier because you know where the problem is coming about, what the developers are doing and the problem that they're having or something that needs to be fixed or new features that need to be added. So it's easier for you to create uh, a, uh, an issue for that particular project. So we encourage every one of us that want to manage a particular project to first try to understand that project and then know what's going on on that project, right? So the next thing is to manage the project board. The project board, there are some issues that have been added in some project to the project board. So it's your responsibility to track which issue is on the backlog or to do or, or is already in process or is done, or maybe there's an issue to be fixed. Is your duty as a project manager to track and see what's going on and then move those issues so that they can get the necessary attention they're supposed to. And then the project management board can also automate so that some processes can be avoided. Once maybe an issue, a SPR has been sent, particular an issue uh, for a particular issue, the issue will be automatically uh, be moved to done and then closed and done. So um, here in this project meeting today, I won't be like, showing you how these are being done uh, practically, but in our next meeting, I'll be practically showing us how we can automate uh, the project management board, then move issues on the project management uh, board so that developers are also following up on what we are doing. But one thing you can also do as a project manager is to, uh, Get your hands on those, on this information on how things are being done, how project um, managers use GitHub project management board to manage different projects. It's very, very important that you know all those. And also, it's also very important that we also know the project we're managing. If you don't have the good knowledge about a particular project, it's good for you to go through read through the, the, the readme and then understand what's going on in that project. And if you look at it and that particular project is so much that you cannot be able to follow through or follow up or manage it properly, um, it's better to choose a project that you can manage properly because it's one thing that is very important that we give reports or uh, a re uh, bring a result of what is actually going on in a particular project we are managing, right? So we encourage every one of us to do that, uh, to know, have a good knowledge of what's going on in any project we are managing. Okay, so that's that from me. Or if you have any question about project management or our board, please feel free to drop questions on the uh, project management managers uh, Slack channel. We will have some discussion as coming in uh, in the following weeks about 
a whole lot of things about project management. So feel free to drop your question. We are there, Rusayo, Yiga, and I will be there to ask, you know, answer your questions. And also be encouraged to join uh, us during the meeting and join if you're managing like a website, chaos website, please. It's very important that you join those meetings so that you know what's going on. And also if you're managing like the developers, one of the projects the developer team are, are working on, it's also very important to you join their meeting to know what is going on. And also have like a kind of collaboration between you and then the technical leads or the knowledge-based lead. So you all be on the same pace for a particular project. And if you have any concern or about issues, you can also reach out to a particular person in or other maintainer or the second maintainer managing the project you are uh, you're also working on. That's why, like Higa mentioned, we have two project managers so that two of you will be on the same thing, on I mean, you'll be on thing to know what's going on and what next step to do. So um, that's that for me. Um, yeah, uh, we'll hand over to Busayo to like find out um, new people that are here and want to be merged to a project or they are not, they don't have any project at all. So Busayo, are you on? I doubt much if Busayo is here. Okay. Yeah, okay, thank Busayo you. Sir. Is no longer on the call. Maybe her network, but she's not on the call at the moment. Okay, no. thank you. Thank you for that. Thank you for that. Um, okay, so um if there's someone here you don't have a project you want to like you are managing at the moment, please feel free to let us know. We can assign a project to you, or if the project is assigned to you, you're not comfortable or you're not like conversant with that particular project, and you might need a change to a project that might be more easier for you to manage and be accountable for. Please feel free to like let us know so we can handle that better. Hi, hi everyone. Good evening. Good day. Yeah, hi. Harmony, how are you? Yeah. This is my first meeting with uh, the project manager's team. So I currently have like little, little knowledge of most of the products there and most of the projects there. So I would want to like go through each of them. The only one I have uh, quite a handful of knowledge is the badging website. But there are people there already which still needs confirmation. So I would want to go through the GitHub link, read about the products, and then decide on the one I'll be able to manage. So that's why I will not be able to make that decision right now. Okay, that's awesome. And that's also very, very good because it's, bit, it's good to manage a product that you can follow through and be able to say, okay, I'm a project manager here and you can easily answer questions when there's anything about that project. That's also, so whenever you are ready with such decision, uh, We'll be here to help you and assign you to a project to manage. Is that okay? Yes, that's perfect. Thank you. Oh, awesome. Okay. Any other person? All right. So, um, in the absence of that, I'm going to be handing over back to, um, back. Uh, back to Yiga to wrap up, but just know that our project management meeting is bi-weekly at this time. If there's newcomers in the community who are looking for where to contribute to, this is the best way for them to contribute because it's, it's kind of like going to expose them to all the product, with all the projects going on in Kiosk. And it will help them to understand the project and be able to also contribute to those project projects. Oyega, over to you, please. Okay, 
Okay, so thank you so much, Pekilia. Thank you, everybody, for contributing. I think that this was a very great uh, meeting. It's a good way to it's a good way to start off. I'm sorry. It's a good way to start off and kick up things back. Um, the other thing that I would like to ask us is um within our circles, right? Because chaos has a lot of projects to be fair. So within our circles, we need to tell people that, oh, there's this project management team where they can contribute to and where they can learn more about, you know, GitHub project boards in practice, right? So if that is something, I think we should also post it consistently in the general chaos group as well and doing chaos Africa meetings. That's like a suggestion so that um, we're able to work you know, we have more people that are able to take up tasks because stuff is always coming up at Chaos. Right now, there's also the Disability and Inclusion Working Group for Chaos Africa. I'm sure that's also going to need a project manager. Do you get what I mean? So that's like the only thing that I want to add. But I just want to say, oh, okay. I just want to say thank you everyone for making this meeting. Um, peculiar, is there a time when we'll, we'll be able to confirm is there a timeline for when we'll be able to confirm the people that you know put up their names before, so we can confirm okay. if? Okay, um, like um, I reached out. We shared it between I and uh, Busayo. So I reached out to two persons, and then one of them is here. That's Hamza, and Hamza has responded mm -hmm. that. He's in too much interested in continuing with his own project. So he's remaining one, one other person. So whenever they uh she responds, I would then update that on the yeah. agenda. It's and precious. beside also my will have uh for the other two to respond before she can put that up. But I'm sure between now and next meeting, that's in the next yeah. two weeks. As we keep reminding them, we might get a feedback from them and then we'll update in the next meeting. Okay, yeah. okay thank you so much. Um, I think that's, that's great. We, we should also consistently um, reach out in the Project Manager's channel as well. So, but that's all for me. Thank you so much for joining this meeting. Thank you for contributing to Chaos. It's such a warm community and I'm sure you feel the warmth as well. So yes, thank you everyone, bye. All right, thank you everyone, bye.